Alright, back with Metal Gear Solid 1, and uh, my save has put me back here. It's not good. Okay, we'll heal. Put on the body armor. Okay. Oh, great, the Queen's back. Love that. Love that for me. Whew. Ooh, what did you drop? Hey, my ration's back. Hmm. Do I still have the Stinger? I do, but let's try the Nikita. Yeah, sure, set off the alarm, I don't care. There we go, Quain's gone. Okay, that ain't gonna work. I'm worried if I stop holding the directional pad the way I'm doing it, I'm going to die. <sighs> what works? Looks like something important over there. Triple shot. Great. Mm, in a minute. I don't want it anymore, I'm scared. <laughs> eh, arguably don't need it. This way! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dumb of me. Somewhat. Oh, wait. Claw wonder. Don't move. Chucky, Chucky. Boom. Cool, Stinger Missiles. Huh. Guess I keep forgetting what that box looks like. Can you stand up, please? Oh, go, 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 go. Hmm. Vulcan? Oh, no, cargo left. I don't trust lips in video games because of this game. I just can't remember if you do it twice. Oh, good. Oh, I'm full ammo, but... At least I remember there was at least one item here. You. 
punch. Punch? There we go, punch. I punch it. There he is. <laughs> that jump animation. <laughs> I mean sound. That does not sound like jumps. Damn. At least you're not invisible this time, eh? Hey, where's my... I don't know why this fight always de-equips your gun at the start. Come on, shoot him, poor boy. I think I don't care about my waiting, so I can use as many Russians as I want. This is normal mode and not hard mode. The embarrassing thing is, it's only three guards! And I did that badly. Ugh. Why am I convinced somehow I'm going to play better with the infinite ammo? I'm also convinced there's a camel up ahead. I might be wrong. Oh, wait. There is ammo there. Ah! You know what? Dasvadanya. I missed! And I did it wrong. Uh, pretty sure I didn't even say the correct thing. Eat that. Evil camel of death. Okay, I deserved that one. I guess. This is where you don't use the unlock stick. I mean, yeah. Please, no more fighting on this one. Blech. I'm gonna regret that. Wavens. Okay, so after Waven, are we? something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. What about her? Is this conversation secure? Don't nope. worry, the monitor's off. Okay, what's up? I was in the FBI too, you know. I didn't know that. What's your point? Dr. Hunter's story about her background, about her grandfather being an assistant secretary to Hoover in the FBI. Yeah. And then going undercover to investigate the Mafia in New York. Yeah, what about it? It was all a big lie. No. Okay. It was really bothering me. Why would she lie about it? She lied? She might be a spy. Ridiculous. Come on, even a high school student could see past it. The head of the FBI at that time, Edgar Hoover, he was a well-known racist. Didn't Naomi say that her father was Japanese? 
Yeah. Well, back then, there wasn't a single Asian investigator. Also, in the 1950s, the undercover mafia sting operations hadn't even started yet. They first started in 1960, in Chicago, not New York. But, hmm. you better check it out. The chief and the president mysteriously dying, and that ninja? Too many strange things are happening. Are you saying that Naomi might be behind it? I don't know. Either that, or she's working with the terrorists. Could it be? If I find out anything, I'll call. In the meantime, be careful. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. Does it actually equip? Because it said I can't use it. This is going to be tricky. <clears throat> nothing and nothing. Cool. Oh, I need the key card. Okay, fine. A minigun? Come on! Cossack, this is the end of the road for you. Right, my friends? Listen, they agree. Ravens aren't scavengers like most people think. They're simply returning to the natural world, that which is no longer needed. Sometimes they even attack wounded foxes. You were the one in the M1 tank? Must have been a tight fit for a big boy like you. <laughs> but that was no true battle. And a Gatling gun is a better battle? Testing to see what kind of man you were. The judgment is decided. The Ravens say you are a true warrior. Cool. Am I hallucinating? Bob, oh boy. I don't think this game had supernatural elements, but actually no. I can't even finish that sentence. This game has supernatural elements. It probably actually saw that. Within your veins, uh, your ancestors too were raised on the barren plains of Mongolia. Inuit and Japanese are cousins to each other. We share many ancestors, you and I. I don't have any crows in my family tree. You jest, but indeed ravens and snakes are not the best of friends. Nevertheless, you will make a worthy adversary. You live in Alaska too. You know of the world Eskimo Indian Olympics? Yeah, what? I know it. Must be a real threat in the muck duck eating contest. Yes, you are right. But there is another event that I excel at. It is called the Ear Pull. It is an event where two opponents pull each other's ears while enduring the harsh cold. It tests spiritual as well as physical strength. You want to pull each other's ears? The form is different. That would be a fun minigame. It's the same. Rejoice, Snake! Ours will be a glorious battle. Yeah, come this on. Actually, would have it's preferred just, just that. Violence isn't a sport. Well, we'll see if there is iron in your words. Ah, please tell me I get my... Yeah, yeah, I get my waiter. And you have, like, the world's longest. How do I get that up there? Saw it coming. Where are you? Why do I struggle with this strategy? Might have to start using Claymores.
Got him! Now we got it. Okay, his view circle is weird. Oh shit. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Hey, Waven! Did we hit him? I'm hearing them explode, but I don't see him taking damage. So why does it sound like he has a cold? Ow! That was dumb. See four. Air game. I'm I'm really gonna use that. I always hated this fight, actually. <laughs> sure. Okay, yeah, no. Let's see. Did he even take damage? I swear I'm going crazy! And then I walk onto my own mine because I'm too worried about him taking damage to actually remember there's a mine right now. Was he even taking damage from the Claymores? Because I heard them go off, but then his health bar didn't look like it moved. So I'm just going crazy. And I've only got one heal, so this is going to be difficult. Can I skip his dialogue? Please. Good! I can, it was just super glitchy. There it is.
Ah, I'm an idiot. Go first person. There's a Russian over there. Ow! You and your ability to hear. There you go. Take that. It's the boost. He can hear the boost, can't he? And I forgot how to stop the thing from boosting. Oh, fuck off. I'm not censoring myself. Just. Screw you! Most part is I've kind of trapped myself. corner wasn't it I have no depth perception I probably won't he should not be allowed to do that in my opinion he's already in his shooting animation okay that was just stupidity Yeah, no, I I knew that wasn't gonna work. It's a dumb idea. I mean that somewhat worked. Is he down there? I want. No. Hey! No, 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 no! Oh, come on! That's my boing. Nice. I mean, this works! Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, that would have been so fun. So he's knocked down a box there. Okay, so 
so he's down there somewhere. Okay, I can see his health bar going down now. What did he step on? I didn't... Did I put a trap down there? Who cares? I did it. We did it! <laughs> Somehow! <sighs> Wine luck. It was just blind luck. No longer needed in this world. It's not a way that I just get lucky with this game. But my body will not remain in this place. My spirit and my flesh will become one with the ravens. In that way, I will return to Mother Earth who bore me. Snake! I will be watching you, understand? Snake, take this security card. Why do I keep forgetting he gives me the level 7 card? This is probably also why I never go back to the snowfield to check that womb. You not that it's po boss. which it obviously must not be you worth it. Another world, a world that I do not Cause by this point, it's too much of a hassle to get back up there. Go and do battle with him. I will be watching from above. Unless there's a fourth tank, I am unfortunately not going back to the snowfield. The man and by did I say tank? I meant truck. Eyes. No, oh, you're giving me the back story on Fox Die, are you? That was not the Dapper Chief. It was Decoy Octopus, a member of Foxhound. He was a master of disguise. Hmm. Bit of a spoiler question, but does he have? A representation so in a into himself. four, or does four have? Yeah, you know, four has Mantis. Think it's supposed to have this guy, and I don't know who the other two are because it's supposed to represent Foxhound members, and I'm like, I don't think they ever so much trouble, even do a duplicate of um, Octopus. <laughs> That is the end of my hint. You must solve the rest of the riddle yourself. I don't think we will. Snake. <clears throat> In the natural world, there is no such thing as boundless slaughter. There is always an end. I am so glad that scene is boily and basically covered, because uh, I kind of don't want to skip. On has no end. But I don't want to show either. What would you say if I was a pacifist for this bit? You shall have no peace. You'd probably still say it. He's gone. This is Vulcan waving. No, it's not. It's about Naomi. Turn your monitor off. What about Naomi? Damn. Colonel, is Naomi there? No, she's away. She's taking a short nap. Hmm. So what is this about Naomi? Okay. Maybe we'd better let the Colonel hear this too. Yeah. Go on, Master. Well, basically, Dr. Naomi Hunter is not Dr. Naomi Hunter at all. What? I thought her story of her background sounded kind of fishy, so I checked it out. And hmm. There is an actual Dr. Naomi Hunter, or I should say, there was one. But she's not the woman we know. The real Naomi Hunter disappeared somewhere in the Middle East. Our Naomi must have somehow obtained her identification papers. So then who is she really? She must be some kind of... spy. A spy? Yes. 
Maybe she's been sent to sabotage this operation. Are you saying she's with the terrorists? <laughs> I don't want to believe it either, but she is working for Foxhound. So you think she had a part in the uprising? Or she could be working with some different group altogether. Different group? Oh, you're wrong on every level. She just wants to kill Snake. Under arrest. What? She's betrayed us. She needs to be arrested and interrogated to find out who she's with. If she's one of their spies, then we're in big trouble. What do you mean? Uh, nothing. Have you let her in on some kind of vital secret or something? Does Neat. this have anything to do with the mysterious deaths of the DARPA chief and the arms tech president? I... I have no idea. Anyway, we cannot allow her to participate any further in this mission. Wait, wait a minute. Without her, we can't complete this mission. I knew it. You're hiding something. Give me some time. I'll try to get it out of her. Hurry then. We've got to figure out who she is and what she's doing here. I understand. I can't remember. Is this part of decoy? Give me some time. I don't have any time left for you. Can I climb onto that? No. Alright, screw it. I'm just gonna move on to the next one. Oh, it is a seven door. How have I never noticed, despite him giving you the card? Oh, lovely, it's this one. You know what? What is this womb? <clears throat> Ka boom. The weird thing is, it almost looks like they don't have vision. Is this a troll room? Can those cameras actually see me? I don't want to find out, but there's that many guns that I'm convinced that they could see, you'd probably get instantly taken out. Hey, we're at Wex! I know this corridor. There it is. Metal Gear Wex. Okay, I think I, with, with it now, you know, in front of me, and not moving, yeah, I, I think I know why this one's called Wex. It looks like a T-Wex. Wait a minute, why is there a gun come with her? I don't remember that. How much can it see? Oh, it can see to here, can it? Sorry, I'm just scouting. Oh, it actually can't see me. Also, did I mistake, like, the tire on the, um, crane as an ammo box? Yeah. Oh, it's Otacon. It's Never mind. What's wrong? Did you find <clears throat> a good place to hide? Yeah, thanks to the stealth gear. It looks like they've finished getting Metal Gear ready. How do you know that? I overheard them talking. Where are you now? Right in front of Metal Gear, but it's strange. What is? There's nobody here. No guards. Nobody patrolling. It's too quiet. There's guards. They're just up Maybe the top. because they're all ready. They said they even input the PAL codes. What should I do? All we can do is use the override system that President Baker told you about. But I've only got one of the three keys. And besides that, like Ocelot said, there's some trick to using the keys. Leave it to me. You got some kind of plan? Well, 
I'm in the computer room right now. I'm trying to access Baker's private files. Baker's files? Don't you need a password? Of course, but there are ways. Are you a hacker? Yep, that describes me pretty well. Nice. Looks like you can get in. I don't know yet. I'll give it a try. I'm counting on you. Actually, can I? Okay, no, it does not give you obvious clues on how to use it. Thought it did. No, I wanted to see if it did. Like, subtly hint the whole, it is all three keys. I do find it suspicious it gives you chalk grenades. <clears throat> no, I'll do that when I'm convinced there's a guard. Okay, ammo. No offense, game, but I don't think giving me assault rifle ammo is useful. Snake, it's me again. How's it going? Uh, not you, bad. You're being a bit jarring there, Otacon. If you can hack into stuff, and you've never met a system that's locked you out, why didn't you just hack Metal Gear? <laughs> Probably because it's not actually controlled by computers. Hmm. Also, if this hell is jamming radar, how does Wex's radar work? Probably because it goes down during that fight. Thank you, I will need those, I think. Oh, cool! I maxed out on the stinger. Hmm. I swear there's meant to be a guard up here, or is it the return trip? Hmm. Or am I just crazy? Don't answer that, we all know the answer was yes. But you know what I meant. Snake, <coughs> I did it! You got past security? Bingo! Great. So what do you got? I accessed the confidential metal gear file. So what about This way, I'm not even gonna make it into the control room to lose the key guard. I haven't found it yet. That's what I need to know. Stop Snake, calling me until you tell me the thing I already what? know because I've the played this game too much. Nuclear weapon. Just as I thought, the nuclear warhead is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. It, it doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Yes, but effective. And that's not even the scariest thing about this weapon. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. You mean it won't show up on radar? Yeah. The truth is, they've been working on a stealth missile since the late 70s. Why weren't mm. they able to develop one until now? Because of the missile rocket propulsion system. It would be picked up by enemy satellites. Oh yeah, that makes sense. But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant, so it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. An and probably modern ones. Totally impossible to intercept. I don't know if you can pick up a well gun, because it's electromagnetic. We learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world. It's the ultimate weapon. And from a political A weapon to surpass Metal Gear! Metal Gear! Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? I'm listening. If word of this got out, it could delay the signing of the START 3 treaty and cause a huge international incident. Yeah, it would be nasty. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. Did you know Neat. this, Colonel? I'm sorry. You've changed, Colonel. I won't make any excuses. Snake, listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested, only simulated. You mean oh, they lovely. The computer model? Yeah, that's why they were conducting this exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? 
It looks like it went better than they hoped for, but I can't find the data anywhere on this network. You'd think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. What? Do you still have it? No. Ocelot took it from me. And we'll the never get it back. I think. Warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So you think they can do it? Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're counting on you. Yeah, that's cool. Let's just punch the stairs to go down the stairs. What is this game? Okay. So there really is no guards up here? Called it. There's one. Power to the knee. I really do feel that I should have actually done stealth uh, requirement instead of a true ending bandana. <sighs> Fine. Snake, did you find <clears throat> it? No, I haven't found out about the override system yet, but I found Baker's ulterior motive. Hmm? He's just looking to get rich, isn't he? Well, that's part of it. Armstech is in much worse financial trouble than I thought. I know they lost their bid to make the next generation fighter jet. That plus the reduction in SDI spending. It looks like there was even some talk of a hostile takeover. Everything was riding on this project, I guess. Neat. It looks like we were paying a lot of bribe money to the DARPA chief. Bribe money, huh? Yeah. And Baker was a big proponent of the nuclear deterrent theory. I see. So anyway, what about the override? Just give me a little bit longer. Come on, man. You literally just admitted they're about to launch. And you're like, yeah, nah. Oh, why? Well, that's how you get in. Keep forgetting that. That little detail. Cool, what happens here? I think I've got time. Wait, there's a camo in there? Okay, I've entered the PAL codes and disengaged the safety device. Why is the end of the game blowier than I remember? There's still no response from Washington. It looks like we'll have to show them. Like, I get it's a modern business. television, but should I set it for Chernotin, Russia? I mean the game yitri was just just blowy. The new target <clears throat> is Lopnor, China. Why, boss? Yeah, what? I'm sure neither you nor Mr. Golukovich would really like to see a nuclear bomb dropped on your motherland, right? Liquid. But why? There's nothing there. Wrong. It's a nuclear test site. A nuclear test site? If we nuke a major population center, the game's over. But a nuclear explosion at a test site can still be concealed from the public. Meanwhile, Washington will be worried about the retaliatory strike from China. That'll probably mean top secret talks between both countries' leaders. Of course. And in the process, the president will be forced to divulge the existence of a new and highly destabilizing nuclear weapon to the Chinese. What do you think that will do to the US's reputation? Or the president's? And with the CTBT, that means that China and India, I see. Yes. Interesting point. Hear about this news, I still don't get it. They'll all want to contact us. Outside of just the Washington that's very, very they clever. They start selling their own system to the highest bidders. Yes, the president will break. He will give in to our demands. Big boss's DNA and one billion dollars. Billion dollars. That money will be used to cure our genome soldiers as well. I'm also including the Fox Dye vaccine in our demands. Fox Dye. It killed Octopus and the Armstech president. So it's true that it affects older people first. Mantis might not have been affected because he wore a mask. Wolf wasn't infected either. 
Perhaps due to those tranquilizers she always took. Something to do with the adrenaline level in the blood. Or maybe it's just because this fox dye was still experimental and they haven't worked out all the bugs yet. Hmm. In any case, have you heard from your friend, Colonel Sergei Golukovich, at the Spetsnaz? Oh, has doubts about the so Metal Gear 1 Metal Gear does connect him to 2. I thought he just showed up out of nowhere. Hmm, he's a very prudent man. Then again, it took quite There's a while. To when when did about. Metal Gear 2 come out compared Metal to this Gear game? And a new nuclear Years later, and right? Can taste it. it was PS2. If Russia wants to regain its position as a military superpower, they need to reinforce a nuclear arsenal. They need a nuclear weapon that can't be intercepted. Metal Gear will allow them to gain first strike capability over the rest of the world. Their regular army is in shambles, and they think they can restore their country's military power with nuclear weapons? Golukovic, he's no warrior. He's a politician. But he's the one who gave us the hind and most of our other heavy firepower. He's got over a thousand soldiers under his command. If we join forces, we could put up quite a resistance here. Since Mantis died, the genome soldiers' brainwashing has started to wear off. I'm worried oh. about the men's morale. An alliance with the Russians would boost that as well. What are you saying? We're not going anywhere. We're going to dig in here. We could still escape. We've got the most powerful weapon ever made, and we're about to ally with Golukovich's forces. Are you going to fight the whole world? And <laughs> what's wrong with that? We can launch a nuclear warhead at any target on this planet. A nuclear warhead, invisible to radar. And on top of that, this base is full of spare nuclear warheads. Once we get the DNA and the money, the world will be ours. What about your promise to Colonel Golukovich? I have no interest in the revival of Mother Russia. You're not thinking of reviving Big Boss's dream. But today, call this place Outer Heaven. How many of them was there? There was... This one, there was the one in the Metal Gear game I've never played. There was the boat. Probably another one. Oh wait, wasn't the boat Inner Heaven? And there was two Orwigs. Any other Outer Heavens I forgot about in the whole franchise? Good. Then no one can stop Metal Gear now. No one can stop Metal Gear except for an idiot with a rocket launcher. And a couple of shark grenades. Let and maybe a sniper rifle, if I feel like it, just to prove that works. We'll keep her as our ace in the hole. No. Oh, right, Sorry. forgot the dialogue's different. <clears throat> Actually, I think the dialogue's the same even if you get the uh, given ending. I'm pretty sure in the ending where you give in to the torture, she dies on top of Wex. So I'm going to get tricked into activating it, aren't I? Only once, huh? Yeah. You better get started. We don't have much time. But it takes three keys, right? I've only got one of them. Hold on a minute. You see, that's the trick. You already have all three keys. What are you talking about? The heat key. The card key is made of a shape memory alloy. Shape memory alloy? Yes. It's a material that changes shape at different temperatures. The key is made out of it. This card key? Yeah. The card key changes shape at different temperatures. So this key is actually three keys in one. Clever. Annoying, actually. Can you see the input terminals in the center of the control room? I see them. Those three laptop terminals are for the emergency input. There should be a symbol You need the, on the yellow screen. one, you need the blue it's one, and you need the red one. Oh, PWS. To right. The left one's for the room temperature key. See the symbol? Okay, that's actually a C, never mind. That's a W. Right is the high temperature. And that's actually a Z. Okay, I got it. First I change the shape of the card it's just, and then I input the When it zooms out, it's PWS. Right. All I do is insert the card keys. 
After you insert the key into the module, but then close up, it looks like a C. Information contained on it. Once you've finished with all three terminals, the code input process is complete. But here's the thing. You can only use the key three times. It's an emergency system. It's only meant to be used once. The world is riding on And they've already seen him. <laughs> Damn. Bye, keycard. I hope you don't get eaten by a mouse just because that's weird. Snake. This is bulletproof glass. There's no way in. I'll enjoy watching you die. <laughs> die to what? You don't send anything after me. Snake, Does he? You've got to get that key. I've actually got to save the game. Well, not save, but, you know, end the part. Oh, okay, well, <laughs> we've got the alert. But on that cliffhanger, I'm going to end the part and see you in the next one. Catch you then.